With the holidays coming to an end, some may already be thinking what to do with the Christmas tree. Jillian Fortner tells us who will collect them. Jillian. You might be wondering what's the best way to dispose or recycle your Christmas tree. Luckily, there are a few convenient options in town. We're here at the uh, composting facility at Knott Landfill, um, which is uh, a pretty active area right now with all the Christmas trees being recycled. From now until January 31st, you can drop off your Christmas trees for free right here at Knott's Landfill Recycling. Before you bring it in, just make sure everything is removed from the tree. We only want the, the natural product, right, that is compostable. So remove all tinsel and lights and ornaments and um, everything that you can off the tree. They also will accept wreaths, wrapping paper, and strings of Christmas lights. If you have curbside collection of compost you can, um, uh, and yard debris, you can uh, cut it up. It just has to fit in your cart. So for many people, it's easier to just bring it down here. Scouts BSA will also be driving around to pick up trees on December 30th and 31st and January 6th and 7th. Trees should be placed on the front curb by 8 a.m. without decorations. The Scouts are asking for those who use their service for a $10 donation. They say the money will help fund their community service projects and troop activities throughout the year. Although it may be tempting to keep up the tree just a little bit longer, fire officials say as the trees start to dry out, they can pose fire risks. Jillian Fortner, News Channel 21. Tonight we are asking, do you have a plan for recycling your Christmas tree? To weigh in, head over to our web poll on the KTVZ.com homepage.